Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and take this one out right there. There we go. Who's that? Oh my god, Jesus! Hello! Thank you for sneaking up on me, friend. There we go. Ugh. Okay. There we go. That's the perfect parry. Alright, switch. Oop. Perfect. Oh, and switch on over and ooh. oh, Jesus, that's bad. There we go. Yeah, those red flashes, unblockable, like critical hits. Oh, done though. Thank you. All right, I think we're set. Let's go and quickly loot the place. Uh, this area wasn't large enough to necessitate like a little cutscene showing us sort of celebrating that we took it over. Those bears kind of like made everything <laughs> annoying for us, but that's fine. Uh, we have an upgrade for our Tonto. That's nice. Let's grab everything here. And usually Mongol artifacts will be what we find in these places here. So uh, ammo is full, which is nice. Uh, and I think because we picked up two, three bear skins at this point, we might be able to upgrade our quiver, which is definitely something I'd like to do. Okay, well. Yeah, that one was kind of like a baby steps, uh, first day on the on the job sort of <laughs> scenario right there. Lots of different ways you can complete these though. Like coming from this way probably would have been a little easier, since you know the leader's uh, tent was right there. But that's fine. Um, I guess we're gonna go head this way. I think we might run into a bamboo strike somewhere along these parts. Don't get me wrong, um, I do not have all of this memorized, like, <laughs> all of these places and where they are. There's a lot of this, this is probably going to seem extremely uh, foreign to me in getting to certain places. But I do think this area actually does look a little familiar. Oh, sir. Kind of just hanging out there. Oh my goodness. What the? Oh, who's fighting over here? Sorry, did I interrupt something? I feel like I did. Alright, I'm out. Sorry, <laughs> that was actually my bad. I'm out, I'm out. Run, run Nobu as fast as you can. Okay, yeah. So uh, like, like in many other games, you can't really escape via fast travel if there's enemies technically on your trail. Oh, this is cute, Keys Pond. I'm pretty sure that is a brewery and we are going to be doing some sort of mission here. Uh, but just while we're here, yeah. Oh, we can do this right now. Uh, how's it going, Key? Uh,まずはお茶でもいかがでしょう。茶？アザモの菊は良い酒を作ると聞いたが。まあまあ、こちらへ。We'll just run inside for once. <laughs> oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Leaving the door closed in my face. ここにももうこの。おかげで樽はすっからかん。味はわかるようだな。お主の酒は島の誉れだ。奴らの酒なんて馬の小便ですから。馬の父と聞いたが、それが酒だなんて。奴らはいつ戻る。Nice, that's the Jin Sakai we know and love. Alright, so we'll grab that leather. I'm just gonna clean this place dry. And... Nice, that's how we do it. Okay, so good opportunity to switch into our samurai clan armor, and now we wait. We wait for the Mongols. Here we go. Thank 
They saw me. <laughs> Oof, okay, so if I remember, I feel like this fight is really challenging this early in the game, so we need to watch out, especially when reinforcements start joining in. And the guys with double uh, swords, they do not mess around, so uh, if you get hit by that, then you might be in trouble. Also, auto-targeting to the other guy is not what I wanted to do. And coming into this fight with no resolve, also a terrible idea. Alright, I think that was your head. <laughs> there we go. Yep, there's always a bigger Mongol. Okay, uh, shoot, why are you guys coming from over here? Oof. All right. Oh jeez, there are totally... Uh-oh. Yeah, archers. Alright, listen pal, that's not very nice. Don't appreciate. And a uh, spear guy. So, spear you, you and your damn halberd. That's not good. Okay. You, you next. Oof. Nice. Yeah. Get him from behind, and you are set. Thank you, sir. Who else we got? I'm. Oh, here we go. Yes, I knew it. Is there someone arching me right now? Excuse me. I don't like that. Huh. All right. Ooh, shit. All right. Thank you, sir. I'm pretty sure I guarded against that, but that's fine. No worries. What about you? You? There we go. Oof. I love not being able to see them. Okay. Yeah, camera can be kind of uncooperative at times. There it is. What are you doing? Was that supposed to hit something, or were you using that as target practice? All right. Oh, oh, sorry. Can't move. <laughs> can't hit a moving target. Jesus, they're everywhere. Okay. So, two archers, and there's the brute. Yep, yep, I'm aware. Ooh, damn it. Ugh. Okay, this guy I'm a little worried about. This brute is gonna take a lot of hits. So, that's why we use this. And, uh, switch on over to... Oh, water stance, and there we go. Look at that. Oh my goodness. All right, Key, how is that? Holy smokes. You know what? Whatever sake you were providing them with, I will take as restitution. Please and thank you. Yeesh. I was I was a little worried there, but no, we, we came up smelling like uh, <laughs> Daisy Saka. What's up? お守りください。避けならいくらでもお出ししますお題も取りませんので人も頭脳れた方がいいありやけの小金寺へ行けかくまってくれるはずだわかしこまりました。Very nice. So we were at least able to get an extra technique point and, uh, you know, some woman points, a little key. And we have a charm of resolve, which also is pretty good. 15% increased resolve gains. To my recollection, I do not think there is, or actually there might be charm of resolve too, which gives us 25%. I don't remember, but it definitely helps. And even if we are going to get rid of one of those soon, uh, that is perfectly okay with me. It would probably be the additional health. I feel like that's not nearly as useful. So yeah, we're set. Um, I'm going to take one last look at a brewery because I noticed some goods in here for us to pick up. Or was it just uh, more sake? Hmm. Nice. Ooh, what's this? Nope, nope. Oh, why would you? Oh, I did not even know this was a place that we could hide in. <laughs> All right, a little odd. I'll take it though. Thank you, thank you. But I still, I still want my iron or linen. Can I? Thank you. Ooh. Right. Uh, let's get out of here. There isn't a lot between us and the pin. I just hope it didn't get rid of it again. There isn't a compass that you can use like on screen. Uh, and it, yeah, it just gets rid of your pin anytime you use that stuff. Oh, by the way, when you liberate a settlement, it'll make a big explosion around it and you can kind of see other things that uh, might be worth your interest. But luckily, we are basically at Archer's Rise. So let's go ahead and uh, keep on making our way through. 
uh, get distracted by more hordes of <laughs> Mongols taking over, uh, you know, private businesses. They don't want to make me go up. I honestly, I hope that I'm remembering this correctly. Because uh, prior to this walkthrough, uh, I didn't do any sort of uh, practice. Uh, and that's been about uh, maybe like three months since the last time I played, but I, I did play through this game twice. And oh my god, there's boars! Okay, boars are pretty good to kill too. They don't give you as much as, you know, a bear, but right now our weaponry is so weak that all we can really do is sort of hit them with an arrow. It's not good. All right, you. There we go. Ooh. Yeah. It's kind of hard to get them on uh, horseback, but close enough. Yeah, three putter hides. Not that great. All right, well, since we're kind of in the general vicinity, I'm curious, where are you going to take me? If you guys remember in the beginning of the game, our caretaker told us that this, the golden bird is our mother incarnate, just like the wind is our father. And luckily for us, there is a hot spring here. So we might as well go ahead and take a look at this and uh, maybe reflect on some stuff. Sometimes they leave you nice little treats like flowers and sometimes linen, but welcome to the rising trees hot spring. Let's take a quick rest and I can drink some coffee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's it's bizarre. You can use um, hot springs anytime after. Also, you just gotta kind of remember that it'll only restore your health, and I don't know that you can reflect on anything so just in case you're low on that and resolve but let's go climb back up here because I feel like that might be the Shinto shrine or the one that's clear up there it's really kind of impressive the scale at which you can sort of explore these places so it's it's exciting but I am curious to see there's also a building down there yeah archers rise itself actually I think this is a rendezvous point for later. I think we come here after rescuing Taka. It very well may be this. So, kind of a neat little place. And it goes to show my lack of foresight, seeing as how we'll be here <laughs> at some point in the future anyway. That's all right. We're still, we're still making our ways out. We're fine. Okay, so anytime you see these, these gates, these will indicate that there is something just ahead for you to explore. And sometimes there will be a little sign that tells you what exactly it is you're looking to do. But I want to avoid whoever's behind me right now. That'd be lovely. Please stay back. <laughs> Please do not touch. So, over the course of the island, you're going to find different types of shrines. And getting to the top and praying at them tends to be a bit of a challenge. We ran when the Mongols came. Father said the Kami will keep us safe. The shrine would be a good hiding spot, offer us protection. Only to see that it's been burned down. Oh! Priestess? Alright. Uh, yeah, you had that song in Guitar Hero 3 and it was great. Whatever happened to you? <laughs> この戦が終わった後、神のご加護を再び求めて、民が uh, okay, did you think that a broom was going to help you out here? 
indeed. So our path is being blocked forward and you can always see where it is you were initially intended to go. But instead we're going to use this as an opportunity to sort of flex our, uh, our platforming a bit. And this is kind of where you can see this turning into a game that might have been released in 2006. It's kind of impressive how dated this area makes you feel. <laughs> but it's not bad by any means, just uh, a little janky and you'll, you'll feel some magnetic physics come on. Like you'll sort of just jump to something that you feel like you might not have. And conversely, you'll also maybe fall to your death where it looks like you might have been able to go to. So, look at this. This is cool. Oh, there's... Is there a mission there? That's not the one that I think it is. There's another fox den. We should probably visit that. Yeah, look at this. Once we get to the top, we'll see a little more. But let's go climb over here and see if we can't make our way up. I do believe uh, the economy of agriculture is the one we're looking for. So, let's go up here. Getting R2 doesn't necessarily mean we need to use it. Okay, so anytime you see these, uh, you'll be in good shape. There you go. And uh, just keep following it. So we're back down here, and we are on the other side of that burnt bridge. Basically, do that ad nauseum, and you'll be good. But every so often, you might find a scroll here or there. Huh. He set fire to the bridge, but they shot him through his leg. He cleaned the wound. And he's sleeping. Actually, I think it's a, a, the daughter that's writing this. It might be the son. But there's also a campfire here. Father's oh, sick. He can't stop shivering or running out of food. But the Mongols are back. They just might find a way across the bridge. I hope not. Alright, grab some more of that bamboo. We'll probably be able to do a pretty good upgrade once we get back. But from here, let's see. I am not supposing I can reach that from here. There's also branches over there. So yeah, let's climb up this and see if we can't make our way around. There is a really cool one uh, a little bit later in the second act that I'm excited to try. It's just like a small, small area, but you basically are just going through the jungle and the trees and I don't know. I have a bit of a soft spot for the second act, but let's go jump over here. And grab some yew wood. Very, very important. What's this? Linen? I'll take it. Alright, we gotta hurry before the sun completely goes down. There we go. Magnetic, I tell you. <laughs> but there we have it. We made it to the top. So, let's go. And before we pay our respects, we can go down here, grab some extra goods, and... At the very top of the Shinto Shrine, I believe it's almost every single one, you'll be able to get some wax wood as well. But Father died last night. I'm so tired, but I can't sleep. Oh, well, the sun's out. It's beautiful. Yes, it is. So with that, we've obtained the Charm of Inari, which increases supplies, predator hides, bamboo, and you would gain from collecting. And because the outline of it is gold, uh, that means we can only equip it in one of these two slots. So we will give up the Charm of Wellbeing for the Charm of Inari. And just in case, yeah, can equip minor charms here. So here we go. We will be using that for basically maybe half of the game while we go and get our stuff situated. So it'll be a good time, I'm hoping. And from here, let's see. Uh, I kind of... Hmm. Yeah. I'm actually a little conflicted. So I, I sort of want to do this. The Ronin attire is not great, but talking about the mercenary straw hats that might be a good place for us to go over the broken blacksmith which is going to be a bit of a journey that is a long mission you know what we've committed so much this far let's do that and 
before we leave, uh, you can kind of explore a little bit around the area. Get the lovely moon there. Uh, casting a lot of light. This isn't the one with like a small other island next to it. Because sometimes you'll see resolutions to these stories, like the one of the father that we saw. Um, yeah, there's not a body around here. I thought this might have been the one, but look at that. Oh, it's so cool, man. Ooh, is that you? Nah, I think that's you. But you know what? Let's go ahead and show this. So you want to be careful if you still want to explore that you can immediately descend the shrine from here. And there's been a couple times where I accidentally just assumed that it was a collectible and I was like, oop, there we go. And there's no shortcut on the way up or for the way up, I should say. So that's a bit tragic, but there's also this outpost. Hold on. Someday we will. Uh, oh, what is, huh? Hi guys, what's going on here? This is interesting. This isn't a lighthouse, but someone has a mission for us here. At least something to say. There are, I believe, eight or nine lighthouses in every corner and every beach of this island that we need to light at some point. And I can't quite see any from here. That's fine. Oh, there's those violent chrysanthemums again. Oh, I'm so excited for that. All right, what's up? あなたも豪華性なさるのですか。何のことだ。猛虎に抗うため、朝物氷に人が集まっているそうです。さような勇ましい民がおるとは心強い。だが少し気がかりだ。様子を見てこよう。Um, okay. I don't remember that one. But let's go and slide on down. And we'll deal with that at some point in the future if we happen to come across it. I just don't know. It's inherently worth it at the moment. Um, yeah, okay. So from here, we are going straight there. So that's, oh, we are very close to it though. Should we just, should we just get rid of it now? We're right there. Minor stealth charm. They're not samurai. That's interesting. Hmm. Well, there's not really anywhere to teleport close to it. And by teleport, I mean fast travel, so we'll come back to it later. I, I can't imagine it being very, very interesting. We also have you would here. Okay, so you see how it pops up once, and then sometimes it'll pop up twice. That's to show you that your charm is kind of kicking in there. Oh, this is bad. Okay, can I go? Oh, just, uh, yikes. I've been trapped. How dare you? All right, I'll be back for you, Nobu, I promise. Just listen for the sound of my uh, my voice, my whistle. 